America is not prepared and nurses are not being protected. <laughs> I quit my job today. I went into work and I was assigned to a COVID patient on an ICU unit that has been converted to a designated COVID unit. None of the nurses are wearing masks, not even surgical masks in the hallways when they're giving report to each other. I had my own N95 mask. I told my manager, I understand we're short on supplies, but let me protect myself. Let me feel safe. I have family that I have to come home to. And the way things are looking, this isn't going to get any better. America is not prepared and nurses are not being protected. <laughs> frustrated and I am very afraid, not because I am faced with taking care of COVID positive patients, but because I go there unprepared, unprotected. While we do have masks that are available, but it's not the right mask that's needed to care for the patient. And we use uh, gowns that are not up to the level of what we need in order to take care of them. And CDC had said a bandana or a scarf is good enough to protect us from the patients. And we know that's not right. Did CDC really say that? Yes. And that was, um, we were hoping that the CDC would be there to protect us, the frontline workers, and yet they failed to do that. And, and so um, we are really scared. We are really anxious because, you know, it's like you wouldn't send a fire uh, fireman to fight a fire with a squirt gun. And why are they doing it to the nurses? Doing it the way we're doing it is much better. It's really much better.